Who are you talking about? What was your reaction? And when did you guys find out? Today or did you find out before? Oh, uh, yeah, I found out. I think I, found, I was in class. And uh, I think my mom, she texted me because she was always, you know, she, she knows the whole situation with this. And she told yeah. me and I was surprised. You know, it's, it's, it's very unfortunate that it happened. But, you know, like Mario, you know, we had our meeting set. You know, college basketball is a business. You know, it's just like a job. You know, if you're not doing your job, then you know, they're going to have to let you go. So it's very unfortunate that this happened. So it's a business. Did, did Chris get in touch with you? Did he meet with you guys at all? Uh, no, I haven't. I haven't met with him yet. I thought we were uh, meeting with him at three, but it was just uh, the players and Mario. You know, did, are you considering transferring? Are you going to come back next season? Or are you going to wait? Uh, 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 there's no talent, really. You know, I don't, I don't know what's going on. I just, I just, I just want to meet the new guy. You know, feel him out, see what's going on. You know, so hopefully I could have style a player or whatever, so I hope I should, but you know, you never know. Kind of a rough man, is it? Yeah, 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 a little, little rough, but I mean, it's, it's, it's crazy. Can you talk about what it was like going through this season? I mean, obviously everybody was questioning the coach. Oh, yeah, you know, it actually started uh, before I even came. You know, there were a lot of rumors and a lot of people, you know, calling me saying that he was going to get fired, you know, before I even came. And then, you know, actually got on campus, you know, it's different from, you know, being outside. And I was on the inside, and a lot of people were telling me I was going to get fired. And, you know, especially since we're not winning games. And then, you know, we had the 43-point uh, loss to Wichita. And then, you know, we, we got record set against us with a three-pointer. So I think uh, a lot of that had to do with, you know, a lot of people telling us. But, I mean, I, I, it didn't, you know, make me lose my focus because, you know, I'm, I'm on the court playing. That's my, that's my business if he gets fired or not. So when you walked out of the arena last night, you know, was it really in the back of your head like he might get fired? But I, I doubt. Was that even in, in a question? I mean, um, looking forward to the next season. I was looking forward to the next season. You know, like I said, that's, that's out of my control. You know, it happens. And just hopefully, you know, we can get a new guy in. But yeah, it wasn't in my head. I was just worried about next season. What was the ride back like? Uh, it was. It was awkward. You know, it was kind of one of those rides where you know. You know, we didn't know what was going on, and, you know, especially because, you know, Coach Lowry and all the coaches didn't ride back with us. So, you know, it was, it, it was a lot of speculating going on, but, I mean, for the most part, it was, it was really awkward. You know, so. is, is it the players' only bus on the way back from the tournament? Yes, yeah, it was, it was the players, the manager, Matt, and Doc Knapp. So, I was the only people on the bus. So that, and that, that's the first time it's ever happened? Yeah. How would you characterize, I guess, the reaction of the group, you know, when Mario told you guys? Uh, I think, uh, I think it was one of those things that everybody, well, most, some of the guys kind of knew it was going to happen. You know, nobody was really shocked or amazed or anything. So it was just, you know, kind of one of those things that, you know, it was, it was kind of a long time to cover. Have you gotten a chance to talk to some of the other guys on the team? It seems like you're kind of out of action and you'll, you'll be back next year or not. What's some of the other guys doing? Uh, I have no idea. I can't speak for those guys. I'm just, you know, worried about me. You know, I'm not being selfish or anything, but I, 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 I haven't talked to those guys. How much do you like it here? Uh, I love it. You know, um, and I guess you can really tell because I had a lot of other business set up. And, you know, I came here and I fell in love with it. Didn't take it to nowhere else. You know, it's a good spot for me. I'm two and a half hours away from my house. So I, I 